All right, so now we're going to look at uh, steaming off the film on the rear screen. Uh, a, a good tip is that when we're working on the car, let's open all the doors because we're going to be in there for 10 minutes with the steam. The steam is going to sit in the, on the inside of the roof. On an older car, it's probably going to damage the hood lining. It could um, dissolve the adhesive and you find the hood lining is going to hang down. It's a great way going from a $200 tin job to 500 bucks in the hole because you have to fix the customer's car. So just remember, keep all the doors open, that way the steam's got place to escape. Okay, so now we've got the rear screen film off. Um, you'll notice it does leave a bit of adhesive. So we're gonna get um, adhesive remover or dissolver. Um, the best off speak to your manufacturer or distributor and the chances are they're gonna have a chemical that's gonna work right for you. So what I'm gonna do is spray it on lightly. I've got a drop sheet down so I don't damage the car at all. Um, and I've got my steel wool. For this to be most effective, usually we would spray the window, wait a couple minutes, give it another spray and really give it time to eat into that adhesive to make it easier to remove. So I'm going to start spraying it and take a closer look. Okay, so you can see the adhesive here, it's turning yellow. Um, with my finger, if I just rub that, that's pretty good. You can see that's working already. Okay, so generally um, you might have to spray it a couple times, but right now I'm pretty happy with that. So I'm going to just give it one little spray again. And now even from the outside, if I just use my steel wool in a circular motion like this, you're going to see that it's going to remove that adhesive. Okay, so now if I was just to squeeze you some of this off. There you go.